competing for third place. He's got that black car in there. And yes, he does go into third place. Passing Hayward. And we're on the last lap. Exciting racing here at the Holman Classic in Terre Haute. Sheldon Kinzer has moved into second place on the low side of the racetrack. Kinzer now second. As they come off of the fourth corner, there's the checkered flag. Ron Schumann wins. And everything so far stands perfectly together for the man in car number 17, Toby Tobias. There's a man who is about to take the checkered flag and does. It's car number 17, and he almost flipped as he came past the start finish line down toward the first turn. Number 17, Toby Tobias nearly flipped as he passed the finish line and into the first turn. And now it appears that every car on the track emitting smoke. Dave Darling, Indiana's Dave Darling second. Down low, he dies for it, pops to the top. It's slide job, they're gonna make a king. Yeah, down low there, he hits the cushion and whoa, catapult him down the back. Darling just stands up and goes. Restart, pops to the bottom. Darling, I guarantee there's gonna be contact here, watch this. Oh, they did nail him. Here comes Dave Darwin. He's coming down. 50 career wins and his first USAC win today in the Holman Classic. There you go. Babbling car. A happy bunch of folks there in the pit area. Looks like he's going duck hunting. No, I can win it from the tail, the, the good Lord willing. The car's right, I'm pumped. Uh, you know, it's, it, I can win it from the tail, it's just that simple. And look at yeah. Terry Pletch. Can you believe that? He started on the last row. He told us he could win this thing, and he has really given it one heck of a try. He did the same thing earlier in the Nationals here. He came from way in the back, and look at the bite he gets off the corner. He's got that race car really hooked up down on the bottom side. Yeah, usually on a track like this, you really have to feather the gas and try to be smooth and patient. And Terry Pletch is just gassing it and really attacking the track. And it's going, he's, he's going for second right now. Whoa, he has got it. Passing Tony Elliott and Terry Pletch is up to second. He's got one more position to go. Now, this is going to go down to the wire, it would appear. Yaley actually looked faster on the cushion that time. He got a much better run through three and four up on the cushion. And but there it is. That. He's got the lead. Pletch has got the lead off the fourth corner and Terry Pletch wins the race.